Hey guys, it's Ashley and today I'm going to be showing you how I style my bangs and just also hairstyles that I wear with my bangs. This is pretty much typically what my bangs look like, but I am going to go grab my blow dryer still and just show you how I do it just since they've kind of they've kind of flattened out over time. But yeah, so this is what my hair typically looks like. You can watch my video on how I keep my hair from being frizzy. I do the exact same thing to my hair just to generally get it looking like this. In that video I didn't have bangs. Now now I have bangs, so I do have to take that into account. But I know that a lot of you guys have been getting bangs. You guys have been DMing me like, oh my gosh, after I watched your glow up video, um, I got bangs. <laughs> okay, so let me go grab my blow dryer and I'm going to show you what I do really quick. <laughs> I'm wearing all gray. Don't judge me. My armpits are not that shaved either. Ooh, there's like hair in this. This is what I use. This is like a blow dryer with the brush on it. Um, I love to be making an informational video. I'll try to link this down below. I got it on Amazon. This thing literally saves my life. The air comes out like slower than a regular blow dryer so it doesn't like make your hair frizz out or anything weird and it's just, it's so much easier to use because I cannot for the life of me use a round brush and like blow dry it at the same time. I can't, I cannot do that. I got myself one of these. It was probably like $30, $40. Um, it's like some Japanese, uh, thingy. I'm gonna put it on the fastest drying setting. And then, so what I do is basically, once I get out of the shower, I do my hair like this, you know, brush it through, get it nicely curled the way that I do. And then when I get to my bangs, this is how my bangs naturally do this weird little wave thing. A lot of you guys, I think, were asking me how I do this, but this is that's just how my hair naturally curls. But, um, so I grab all of my bangs in the front like this. Turn this on, and I just go like this underneath it, like that. And that's pretty much it, but as you can see, my hair does this like, makes it look like the Lululemon logo. <laughs> Whoa, my socks are gray too. I want to make it look a little bit more puffy than this, and I'm just going to kind of like pull it across and kind of curl it at the same time. Pull it across and curl it. Brush it through and maybe let it kind of dry the curl, like let the heat dissipate while you hold it like this. Okay. And so that is how I get my bangs into the desired shape. And then now I'm gonna show you guys some of my favorite hairstyles to do with bangs. Where are my ponytails? Help. I've just got two of them and now they're gone. Oh, they're right here. Okay, let's do, let's... <laughs> let's add some hair accessories because that will make your hair look more interesting. This is a green headband. I love this green headband. Um, I think I got it like years ago in like seventh grade. How long ago was seventh grade for me? Eight years ago. <clears throat> That's kind of weird, but yeah, you can just go like that. Obviously, if you want to hide your ears, pull out a little bit more hair. And I love to use like a bright color. And then, let me grab another accessory to show you guys. I just stole this scarf from my mom's closet. It's like a little square scarf, so I'm just gonna fold it into a bunch of triangles. So now it looks like this. It's like a, get it to like bandana size. <laughs> <laughs> Why am I suffering? Um, yeah, it's like bandana size. And then you want the pointy triangle area to be on the back. And, and, can you tell that I've never done this before? And so yeah, get the point point on the back and we're gonna tie a little knot. <laughs> Why am I stupid? Okay, so I'm gonna go like this and get all of my hair through it like that and then pull it up. Oh my God. Why does this look like my hair is not like I feel like I work in a cafeteria. Oh my god, I don't know if you guys ever had those Asian pears when you guys were like little, if you're Asian or not Asian, I don't know. But they sell like the Korean Asian pears with like the little net on it, like right on top. Maybe I'll insert a picture so you can understand, oh my god, the culture. But yeah, so they have a little like foam net on it and when I was little and my head was big enough to fit that little net, I used to put it on. Like I used to put the little net onto my head and then walk around and like cart this little meal cart that I had and that's just so funny. I wonder if there's a picture of that. But like, that's so funny. Oh my God, my mind. I was like, yes, this is exactly like a hairnet. Let me wear this and then cart around my plastic food. Oh, my brain was so advanced. My brain was literally so advanced. This is not looking too bad, if I do say so myself. But yeah, I see girls wear their hair like this all the time and it looks so good on them. Let's take a look at how it looks in the back. Don't roast me. Damn. 
damn, why can't I make it look good? We're gonna try one more time. I'm sweating and I'm dying. Okay, we're gonna use a bigger triangle. Oh, okay, so we're gonna use a bigger triangle. Yeah, we're gonna roll it and then once you get it like that, then we're gonna tie it underneath with the longer area thing. This is definitely how I'm supposed to do it. Oh, okay, that works. Oh, this actually, okay. How do these people do it? Okay, we're gonna pretend that that worked, even though that definitely is not how it's supposed to look. I think I just need a smaller scarf. Bro, I think I just did it. Okay, so tie, tie it around your neck first, and then you pull it back over your head. Oh my god. Okay, well I tried my best with that and now we're gonna move on to the other hairstyles that we can actually do and that I actually know how to show you guys. Next up, we are gonna do some double buns because I think double buns are so fun and you can do them two ways, not really two ways, you can do them with scrunchies and you can do them without scrunchies. So I'm like not really a scrunchy person. I like to just use regular hair bands, but it is kind of fun if you use the scrunchie and they stay in your hair better if you use the scrunchie. So I'm gonna show you with scrunchies and without scrunchies. Okay, so I have these two, like these are like mini scrunchies that I got from Princess Polly. They're like not as big as normal scrunchies, but that works really well for these, but you can use regular scrunchies, whatever floats your boat. Obviously split your hair down the middle. So I'm gonna pull it up. Don't look at my armpits. Kinda cover up where I'm balding. <laughs> where I'm literally balding. And then we're gonna tie up a bun. It's so easy. Oh my God. Mini little bun. We're gonna go back up and fluff them up. Don't worry. Don't you <laughs> worry your precious little head. Oh my God, I'm so nervous going today <laughs> there we go. oh I forgot to pull out more hair here ow, ow. okay and then now you puff up the buns ooh ooh yes I need a better mirror I can't look in the view I'm gonna look at the mirror behind me just kidding I lied I'm just gonna look at nothing I'm gonna use only five of my senses oh my god and I look like Hello Kitty or something okay there we go that that looks good enough to me they might be a little bit lopsided but you get the point and I try my best that's what it looks like oh my god I actually love this those are my little buns you can add scrunchies if you want to and I could have just tied these originally with just the scrunchies and it would have stayed in but didn't feel like that obviously so yay that's how it looks with scrunchies I think it's kind of funny I like how it looks with the two different color scrunchies also that's kind of funny I think it's so fun to have your hair up in two buns I don't see people wear their hair like that that much so I think it's really fun and and I think it's cuter than pigtails. No offense to pigtails. Ow. Oh my god. Wait. Do I look like a Korean grandma? What do I look like like this? Tell me who I look like. Someone comment in the comments what I look like because I know I look like someone but I just don't remember who. Princess Layla? Maybe. As you guys know, you can also just do one huge bun on top of your head. Before you tie it, pull out your bangs, pull out any of like your little side hairs that you want to get out. Oh, that one's a little bit too long. Okay, and then we're going to do like a huge messy bun. Twist, twist, twist. Keep twisting it and just doing that at the same time. Put in a ponytail, regular looking bun, and then just pull it out. Just pull it. That was kind of fast. Um, did you guys catch that? But that's how I just do one big messy bun. You can also put a scrunchie around your huge bun if that's something that you would like to do. But I like it just like that. You could also wear headband, blah, blah, blah. Now another one of my favorite hairstyles is to just do double pigtail braided ponytails. So this one I can do really fast because I've been doing it for like years. I'll just show you generally how I braid my hair. It's a, just a Dutch braid or you could do a French braid as well. You just continually put each side. So like right side under the middle left side under the middle and you just do that over and over and over again until you're all the way down your head just grabbing chunks of hair with your thumbs I kind of like to leave this area loose and then grab it when I'm lower down with my hair it kind of swipes the hair over my ear and keeps my ear against my head and then I'll just do the same thing to this side really quick <laughs> I'm like leaving out a piece of hair. Mm. This guy, that wasn't supposed to happen, but just pretend like he's not there. Just since my braids are kind of skinny, I'm gonna pull them out just until they're nice and fluffed. 
But yeah, anyway, so I feel like you can do like literally any hairstyle that you could do without bangs, with bangs, almost. And then there you go, you got one nice big and, well, two nice big and fluffy braids. And then obviously, ooh, obviously you could also add like a headband, bandana, whatever you want to literally any hairstyle. Anyway, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I just wanted to show you guys a few hairstyles that you could do with bangs and just generally how I style my bangs, which is obviously really simple, just... Gotta go like that. But yeah, that's all for the video, so make sure to double tap the like button, double tap the subscribe button, and make sure to click confirm when it asks you to unsubscribe, and I will see you guys next time. Thank you so much for watching. Peace.